33 year old male in Greece. Why am I showing these pictures? John Kalampoulos, December, right before the holidays. Obviously, a severe coloconus patient. Um, comes in contact lens intolerant, progressive disability, and his uh, visual function, his vision has dropped to count fingers. We can see the extreme steepening, cardiometry is 50, 658, steepest case 72, minimal thickness 414. And um, of course here, cornea transplantation uh, is uh, a, the golden standard, significant consideration. Cornea cross thinking will probably stabilize this cornea, but not offer significant visual rehabilitation. So we went ahead and performed the Athens protocol. Our uh, treatment uh, included um, minimal uh, cone and refractive error correction. We just treated a minus two, minus three at um, 0, 15 degrees with an optical zone of five millimeters and transition zone of two millimeters uh, and a PTK to remove the epithelium, seven millimeters in diameter, 50 microns in thickness. And this was in January, here in December, 11 months later, you can see a dramatic flattening, our steepest case in the 50s, low 50s. Uh, cornea thickness is an artifact from the appendicum, it's not 299, it's about 380. Um, and this is a difference map, which I wanted to share with you. We can see a dramatic flattening of over 20 diopters here, uh, making this patient go from a uncorrected and best corrected count fingers to an astounding uh, 20, 40 minus uncorrected corrects to 20, 30 minus with um, minus two, minus three and 90 degrees. Let's go see the difference maps on um, topometric indices. We can see why this improvement, we went from an IHD from 386, ISV 199, extreme numbers to 193 and 142. Obviously the secret here is that this was a very central comb. Let's look at the OCT cross sections to see that our treatment did establish a very deep cross thinking line. You can see how prominent it is. And we can see that the real cornea thickness is uh, around uh, in the center around 467. And the epithelium is almost remodeled. This should turn all green in order to say that the patient has um, recovered. Let's look at the external uh, pictures here. Uh, we can see this eye with the crown glass or preemptive of cross thinking, but relatively clear cornea. Uh, the other eye was very minimally uh, affected. And again, um, to look at the other options here uh, on our imaging today, um, whether uh, this patient will be treated a cornea transplant or uh, the Athens protocol, I think practice proved that it is a very viable alternative uh, to be able to avoid a cornea transplant. This patient with a minus two contact lens is functioning in the 2040 level. And again, a testament, let's see the difference maps uh, on uh, Pentacam, a testament of how this uh, procedure can give dramatic flattening. Of course, uh, this is the X factor of cross thinking since the laser ablation itself uh, can account for about four to five diopters of normalization. Um, again, um, this in combination with possibly an ICL can uh, eradicate uh, the significance of keratoconus in most, most corneas are over 380 microns in their third point. Uh, John Kalamopoulos signing out.